Hey, 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 Big Dave the Middle Age Gamer here with another episode of Sim Settlement 2 for Fallout 4. We're back outside of Vault 95. Because we need to finish with Kate, get her fixed, and then maybe get ourselves a new, com new companion. And she is just about maxed out affinity wise. Let's do this. As we go down the elevator, the first thing we see is a dog's butt, and now his face. Hello, boy. And no sign of Kate anywhere. Oh, there she is. Falling through things again, are we, Kate? You're good at that. Yeah, boy. All right. Moving on. We've done just about everything here, except one particular direction, and it's this way. And it's blocked by a master hack. We can do it. Alright, what do we got? One, two, three, four, five, six choices. Only four guesses. We're gonna need some help. Okay, five. We can find one more dud to remove. Then we can just brute force our way through this. There we go. There we go. All right. <laughs> we happened, dear. there always knew the gunners were a bunch of sniveling cowards but that's ridiculous And that's how you get around legendaries. Right to the head. Colonel Knuckles, are you fucking kidding me? Fucking waste of a legendary.
Look familiar? empty. Don't mind the lurage there. That happens sometimes. Oh, we're finally down to caution, huh? Morons have finally settled down. And that's how you fix that. Nothing in there anyway. Otherwise, we'd have seen them. Exploding rat gun? Yeah. Sending rads and explosive damage. I recognize the popping. Okay, he's dead. But if that's what I think it is, that should be really interesting. Ah, radium rifle. Okay, that works. It's our first radium rifle, I think. And explosive damage, that's a fun one to turn into an automatic. It's certainly a lot better than nocturnal knuckles. the regular gunner. There's a conscript or something over here, I thought. Yep, that's the conscript. So where'd the legendary go? We got his toy, but... There we go. Oh, well, there's part of him. Okay. Good enough. Continuing on. And we're almost there.
right? We're going to want to go in there last. That's where we ultimately need to be, and... That commander's a pain in the ass. And he's got the whiny little bitch voice, too. Who's there? You're really pissing me off. Thought I recognized something there. Handful of bottle caps. Come on, pup. Pup. Uh, gotta love dog meat. Sweet. Okay, we're gonna save and we're gonna wait. Wait until the heat dies down. Because we're not getting in until we activate this terminal. Okay. Well, that takes care of that at least. Uh, you know, I got a crit. <laughs> well, that's done. Save again after a, a rather successful fight. Nice little plasma pistol there. Not legendary, but at the very least dismantleable. Hey. Yeah, boy. Okay, you can hold on to the weapons that I don't need. Boosted, agitated, and tactical. Okay. And that wears down our takes down our inventory a notch. And now, major drama alert, and I'm not being sarcastic. Uh, yeah, let's leave the lights on. Hey. The answer to me problems is sitting in that room. But I don't know if I should go through with it. Don't you want to get better? I don't know. My body's telling me to get it over with. But what if the psycho's the only thing keeping me together? What if this opens me eyes and I don't like what I see? There were reasons I dulled the pain. Things I didn't want to face. Things I was trying to forget. I'd rather be spitting blood than relive in the past. We'll face that pain together. You... You've already done so much, but you keep offering to do more. Well, who the hell am I to look a gift horse in the mouth? I'm gonna sit in the chair. Whenever you're ready, you go ahead and throw the switch. Okay, so now we wait for Kate to do her thing. Let her sit down. You <laughs> silly boy. All right, here we go. Let's 
seeing the machine doing its work and putting her through the paces. This does not sound like pain. Alright, let's go talk to our dear Kate. Are you alright, Kate? How are you feeling? Strange. I feel really strange. Everything feels different. Everything feels clearer. Colors. Sounds. Smells. Nothing is like I remember. I... I can't believe it worked. The cravings, the pain, hell, even the rush. They've disappeared. Was I really that far gone? I'm glad you're all right. I was worried about you. Seems you're not the only one. I have a feeling that Tommy had this in mind all along. Clever old bastard kicked me out of the combat zone so I'd clean myself up and somehow knew you'd be up for the challenge. I guess he saw something in you that I missed. Oh well, yeah, my charming personality. <laughs> something like that. Look, I'm never gonna forget what you did for me today. You stepped up and helped when everyone else cashed out. I know I suck at thank yous, but that's the best you're gonna get out of me. Now, how about we get out of here and leave this place far behind? You're gonna drag that into the Alright, so we're gonna loot this place first. Alright. And we got somebody new at Jamaica Plains, so once we're done here, we're going back. Flag unlocked! Kate! This is a dynamic flag that was selected from a city planner's desk to change all settlement flags to match. It is buildable under the decorations menu. Two bats and a knuckles. Yeah, that sounds like her. Our little pit fighter. Hey. Ready to head back out? Ready. Good. Then let's get moving. Don't look at me that way, you dirty little mole rat. Dirty little mole rat? Hey. This better be worth it. Um, hey, you got a sec? You wanted to ask something? That's all for now. Fine by me. All right, let's get out of here. She'll want to pester us when it's when it's time, but we have maxed out our relationship, or at least I think we have. Maybe it's because we were sitting at nine nine nine, and we got to wait for that last point to tick. All right, let's get out of here. She should be coming along. There's the pup, and there's the Kate. She's looking a lot better now, you can tell. Okay, we're done. And off we go back to Jamaica Plain. Back! At Jamaica Plain. And just like I said, our new settler grabbed caravanning back and grabbed the spot at the at the intelligence table, which is exactly how I planned it. All right, now we need to build a new residence for our next settler, whoever that may be. Alright, 
Let's fine tune this a little bit. Hey. So we got that queued up. Alright. And we can get rid of this now. Because we got the calm place. Gonna take a look at what it shows, see if it will work with what we've got. Slum lure number one. Entrances from right end and left front. No. We'll swap it to slum lure number two. Because we want the left end entrance. That will do better for this. Okay. But now we need to set up for a job for the next settler. And that's going to be a hospital. Why a hospital? Well, because that's the only other thing that really requires intelligence. So that way we don't have to build another one, we just stick the next settler there. up for a hospital. And that will do for now. Yes, we have everything concentrated in this little square. All right, before we get out of here, we got to loot a few things over here. There's some blood leaf there. Yep. Okay, so we're done here. We're going to save. And we are going to go to. We're actually going to go here. Why are we going here? Well, hold up. <clears throat> you need to talk. How do you think things are between us? 
you and me versus the Commonwealth. I'd say those are damn good odds in our favor. Nothing else I needed. No problem. Hey. What you need? Hey. What's the matter? Okay, we're not getting anything new. That was all. Sure. All right. So, I guess for now, well, we need to sell shit, so we'll do that. To the castle we go. Hey, it's up to 80%. Back at the castle. Alright, and this place always kind of trips me out a little bit because of the levels. And, okay, that power is just being flaky. Does not look like we got anybody new. So, really only one thing for us to do, and that is to find... Ronnie, who should be at her post in the armory. There she is. Hey there. Running low on supplies, General? Let me see what you've got. Take a look. We'll hold on to those. Hmm, too much, huh? Whoop. Yeah, it's about as good as it gets, huh? Heads up. Let's take our weapons back. And no caravans are here. Fine. Oh, we have another shop, don't we? You're a custodian, you're not the shopkeep. Right, let's find the proprietor, see if we can sell some things to them. Ugh, I hate it when that happens. Just wanted to trade a few things. Sure thing. Mm-hmm. Must be uh, after hours. It is after hours. Okay, never mind. Let's turn off the tracking. Alright. Let's go to Diamond City Market. Back again at Diamond City. Underwear? I'll take a look, sure. Oh, goody. Okay, we sell our junk. And that whittles us down considerably more. There we go. I mean, I'm still carrying a fair amount, but it's mostly junk and stuff I need to put up. Okay. Look at the uh, Better Companions tape. Kate. Alright, we're still at 999. So we just need to trigger that last point. And she doesn't like Minutemen quests, which is kind of the reason why we're kind of bailing on Somerville for, for now. All that, we want this to develop a bit more.
Okay, we're gonna save before we go, but I just want to make sure Abernathy is cooking the way it should. And back again at Abernathy Farm with the lovely view of concrete. Okay. There we go. That's what we were waiting for. Was that message that says Kate idolizes you? Okay. Alright, happiness is still falling down. We're still lacking in beds. Let's bring this up. This is going to take a minute to uh, fire up. And we'll see just how badly things are looking while we're waiting for things to build from 88 to 85. Ouch. All right. Let's count the unemployed. Zero. Let's count the homeless. Four and the board. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ouch. All right, let's take a look at what uh, what we've done, see if anything is upgraded. And quite clearly, the entertainment has not, and neither has... Oh! But the tax collection has, and... <laughs> we could have had... Well, if we end up with another uh, seller, at least they'll have a job. So nothing that we need to upgrade yet has upgraded, so it's going to be sitting there for a while. And Yeah, happiness is just going to take a dump for a little bit until we get that squared away. Now, where's Kate? Actually, you know what? Since we've seen what we need to see here... We're going to go back to Jamaica Plain. Actually, that's not entirely true. We're going to go to the Western Water Treatment Plant, because where we need to go for something is the nearest spot. Okay! Whoa, what the... What the fuck? Crap. Crap, 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 crap. if we could take out one of the legs. Okay, so that leg is toast. The farm improved the green top. Yeah, totally. I always have time to listen to you, Kate. Good. Because this isn't easy for me to say, but I want to get it right. Where do I begin? Did you know I spent three years fighting at the combat zone? Three years of getting beaten to hell by a bunch of losers and lunatics. After the matches were over, I'd spit out the blood, stitch me wounds, and do a couple of shots of Psycho to keep me going. I fucking hated it. I hated the crowds, I hated the other fighters, and I hated myself. 
I never understood why he put himself through all that. Until now, it was because I was alone. And I think deep down, I wanted to die. I wanted one of the opponents to crush the life out of me. The easy way out. Well, that's the past. You're not alone anymore. Then maybe you know what I'm trying to say to you. My life's been nothing but one huge failure after another. You've heard all my stories, and you know the prices I've paid. There were a few times when things got really bad, but I... I found myself staring down the barrel of my own shotgun. I don't know why I didn't pull the trigger. I guess I was praying that I could find a single decent scrap of humanity in this fucked up world. And then, what you did for me back there at Fog 95, it was like the answer to those prayers. That's the first time in my life I fully depended on someone else, and they didn't let me down. God damn it, I'm making a mess of this. It's all right, Kate. Let it all out. I'll be fine. I just need to be getting to the point. The longer we've been spending time together, the more I'm beginning to realize what you mean to me. And I'm not just talking about you watching me back or sharing a drink together. I mean more than that. Before we met, I'd never let me guard down around anyone. I didn't dare. But with you, I feel like I can let you in and see me for everything that I am. For better or for worse. Look, I can't go back to the way things were before we met. I won't. But what I need you to do is look me in the eyes and tell me you feel something too. Of course I do. I'm in love with you, Kate. You... you're what? You said... You're in love with me. I... I didn't know. I mean, I felt something between us. I thought it was something else. Why? Why would you fall in love with someone as screwed up as I am? To tell you the truth, we're both a little screwed up. I can't argue with that. This has to be the first time I put all my cards on the table and didn't end up losing everything. You don't know how much this means to me. To have someone special in my life, I promise you, I mean to make the most of it. Alright, let's take a look at the Trigger Rush perk. Trigger Rush, thanks to your relationship with Kate, action points should regenerate 25% faster. Hell yeah! save and I guess the super mutants never come back nice but well, we're heading off south uh, what the hell was that a bombastic river rat I need to recognize where we're at that rat's gonna leave us alone, I, I, I'm guessing. Fine with me. Look at the map real quick. Uh huh. Yeah. You know what? We're big and tough. We're strong. I think we can handle some baddie. Some, uh,. Nature baddies, if we need to. Actually, we should probably head upwards. Hello, Kate. Now that we've relaxed, maxed out our relationship with Kate, we've got somebody new at Jamaica Plain. Oh, look at that. First thing we're going to do is we're going to head... Gunners. A gunner and his privates.
All right, the hospital has now been set up at Jamaica Plain. Perfect. Now we just need to trigger this area here so we can come back. But y'all should recognize this area now. I've been here quite a few episodes ago for some settlements too. I just need to trigger Finally! And you're also sent here by Solomon for these little gems here. And you also end up having to deal with a bunch of these fools. And that's who we're eventually going to be hitting up, but I want to set up a place for Kate first at Jamaica Plain. And yes, Birdie will be our next companion. Shit. Okay. We can take that off. Now that we got that marked, we're going to go back to Jamaica Plain. Okay, now we should be able to head back to Jamaica Plain. Back at Jamaica Plain. And, oh, don't give me that. Okay, it's just being stupid again. The hospital's all set up. And we're not quite happy enough, and yeah, boy, do we need defensive help. But first things first. We need to build another place to live.
That'll work. Okay, we got ourselves a new resi. Now we need to set up a new thing for Kate and... Oh, hey, Doc. Set up a defense plot over here. That's a good place to put it. Actually, I'm going to put it out a little more. Actually, no. We're going to leave it there. That is a good spot. Actually, don't need to do that. Look at her stats one more time. And she's already got a sick perception and a sick agility. As in maxed. I mean, her stats are terrific. Alright, let's let that do its thing. But the next thing we're going to do, I mean, the, what this place needs more than anything else is defense. That's why we got that set up there. But we need to set up a happy fun time place. And I need to figure out a decent place to put it. that there. Give us some light. And we'll make this an agility trainer. So we can get some, uh, so we can get multiple guards out here. For Kate, we'll set this up as a high tech. Be kind of a waste to give her a watchtower for now. All right, where is? There she is. Heads up. What is it? <clears throat> Need something, lover. I think it's about time we called it quits. Sure. Uh -huh. Don't stay away too long, or I might start getting lonely. And we're going to leave her here. So she can build up some good defenses. And entertainment. And a new place to live. And we can put the next defense plot like over here.
See how the house building's going. It's going just fine. So we will get a new pad queued up. Here. Security is set up. Let's see just what the hell we ended up selecting. Hotch quad on column. Oh, wow. Okay. Well, that'll hold for a few people. Entertainment is set up. Let's see how much entertainment we've got. Oh, defense is beautiful now. Good. And three people, huh? Perfect. Uh-oh. We're suddenly lacking power, huh? That has power, but the light does not. That's kind of trippy. Alright, we're still lacking power. And if we're just getting settlers in here, then... We'll actually leave this and let them develop it at their own pace. It'll pick something based on the settler. If we don't choose it, that will give us everything else we need for now. And we could put another defense plot here, since it's close enough to some power. Well, once we get more. But for now, this place is coming along. And once our mechanic intelligence gets up higher, it'll put us in even better shape. They must be in their room. There we are. They're standing on their bed. Intelligence of two. Oh boy. <laughs> We're going to be there a little while. So this is Kate's spot. All vaulty and everything. Nice. Ugh, dog meat. Okay, so... Yeah, this place is coming along a little bit. We just got one, one last thing we... Actually, two last things we need to do. One is turn off the tracking. And you know what? This video is starting to get a bit long. 
Eh, screw it. Let's just get him before I forget. Let's go get Birdie. Back in Forest Grove Marsh. Coming at it from a different angle. Okay, he fell and he's gonna come at us. Okay, we need to get up. Well, if nothing else, that Reaver just showed us how to get up. Now, let's go find Birdie. Entertainment improved at Jamaica Plain. I'm guessing that would be the crafteria, which is nice. Did Birdie go? I think the proper answer is he didn't go anywhere. Where was he to begin with? Shit. There he is, and he's asleep. How the hell did he sleep through all this? <laughs> Wait for me to get back before you take the first load to Diamond City. I've got a couple of things I want. Hey, Sheila! That you up there? The walkways look great, but how do I get up there? There you are. Took your sweet time, Dale. Head over a block, there's... Oh, Ferrells. <laughs> hey there. 
the gun down. So, you're not a shambler. Good thing I didn't shoot you. Um, would have been, uh, I don't know, awkward? <laughs> Sure. After all, I help you fight those ferals. That's what tipped me off. Also the skin. And the hair. And that winning smile. You should be a shampoo model. To sell toothpaste. Not sure if that would be a conflict of interest. I'm going with yes. <laughs> Who are you? What are you doing out here? Yeah, so uh, that's two questions. Only got one mouth, so I guess I'll go with door number two. What am I doing here? I think I was... Trying to throw away ammo? Would explain all the shells. Nice work. Glad you're on our side. You too, Fred. You, you do excellent you? work. Uh, we're friends, right? I assume that's why we're talking and not shooting. I don't remember meeting you, though. So, tell me. Why the mask? You didn't know! Yeah, hate to break it to you, but there was this whole war. Things got blown up, left a lot of bad things in the air. Dust, dirt, something called asbestos. Why do I wear a mask? First of all, you gotta keep a safe and secure workplace. You by yourself out here? Oh, uh, you're here too. Where are you headed? I, uh, well, I don't remember. I know for sure I was going left. But then it got turned around, and left wasn't left anymore. It was right. Maybe I'll go back. But is back forward now? Or forward, back. <laughs> you can travel with me. See the world. Or what's left of it. That might be easier. Alright, I'll follow. But it's probably good to keep a healthy distance. I don't like sharing air. It's like drinking from the same glass. Or kissing. Which is weird, you know, because we just met. <laughs> okay, that's Birdie, and I think we're going to leave it here. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to get the latest and greatest videos as they come in and to help this channel grow. It's been Big Dave, the Middle Age Gamer. This is Sim Settlement 2 for Fallout 4. I'll see you all next time.